Okay. Yeah. You can let it in the water. Bring it. Over the... Okay, well, I'm seeing little black dots moving around, which I assume are plankton. Now, this one's especially peculiar, peculiar over there, which it because it's kind of like it have a clear dot in its back. Hold it closer to the light. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I think I see something over there. It's a little blurry. I'm gonna try the other dish. Up to the light. Alright, what do you see? What do you see? Oh, they're they moving did. around quite a they, bit. They're all yeah, moving yeah, around. They yeah, they're really moving around. But then again, plankton are, are kind of. Well, there's, well, there's definitely some phytoplankton in it. And some zoo and and the ones that are moving around are most likely zooplankton. Okay. <laughs> zooplankton. There might be some crow in there, but I'm not entirely certain. I think that was what we were. A couple of them, right? Now these ones are probably now these ones are probably uh, phytoplankton. I'm assuming, and that would be zooplankton. I am. I'm just yeah. trying to identify them. Look, There's also definitely some other single-celled organisms yeah, in there. Yeah. And yeah. like I, and like I said, there's definitely a couple of uh, amoebas. Yeah, you definitely. So the three things I'm looking at here are phyto zooplankton, phyto and zooplankton, and uh, and amoebas. Yep. Basically, basically, basically a bunch of things that are that are single celled. See, you can't see that with the naked eye. So like I said, amoebas, phytoplankton, and zooplankton. And I think that, I think we're good here.